Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, cats and kittens, welcome back to the podcast. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Love having my good mic back. I, you know that other one. So it, it's it's decent. There's there's nothing wrong with it. It's just you know why not use the best if you have the best and this is the best. So here we go. Uh, clearly back in studio, guys. Thank you for your uh, patience. Why I was uh, out of town, still doing the fiat thing. It's weird too, man, because I, I don't I don't need it, but. Yeah, what do you do if you're not working? You know, that's that's usually that's really where it comes down to. And as much as I'd like to uh, to to fully dedicate my time to crypto and crypto reporting and all that other stuff, I just don't want to turn into what everybody else has turned into, and uh, just basically, I mean, it, I I don't want to go that direction. I'd like to do my own thing, but uh, my own thing is. Uh, basically my own time so i'm not sure if i want to if i want to go that direction or not we're still kicking it over so uh yeah look man we're gonna do i i like just the little ones uh, i'm fine with it they play well on twitter they p play well on uh on youtube and uh here we go guys man waking up now this is nothing new bitcoin volatility this is nothing exactly new or scary or anything that should be uh terribly intimidating i actually make more money on uh, on down days than I do on on up days, and there's a reason for that. It's because uh, seventy percent of my entire holdings are invested in DPIN, in uh, cash, in Jackal, kudos, etc. Because they to me seem like the safest yet most uh, profitable long term plays. So that's why I'm going to have my money where I think it's treated best. It's treated best there, and it's working out. But uh, I still have uh, I still have a, a bulk that uh, I, I like to play around with. That's your passage, that's your hash, that's uh, 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 vigilum, and some of these other just wonky ones. And those are the ones that, believe it or not, are, are most affected by this. Uh, again, when you're talking about long terms, I, I don't care about the day-to-day -day volatility. It means nothing to me. They have to develop. They have to continue to get customers, and that just it takes time, man. You know, it's business. And uh, this is uh, these other ones are are not really uh, those types of investments. So I don't get real real fussed of, uh, about them. But they are the ones that I'm going to move in and out of very very fast. And uh, yeah, today is one of those days. So uh, it, it's important. I know we, we never mention this. Nobody mentions this. Nobody ever talks about this. So we say, buy the dip. But nobody ever says, how are you supposed to buy the dip when you're spent? And what I mean by spent is you have everything on the board. I respect that. I do. I respect that you you have your vision and you see it and you've pushed everything in, but it leaves you no wiggle room. And it, it does to me. It doesn't make sense. You should. I, I keep approximately 20 percent of my total holdings in cash and I keep them in cash for days like this. Exactly for days like this. I make more money on days like this because I keep cash handy. And I will go into the wild ones on days like this because I'm just looking for uh, some percentages, a little bit of percentages, and then I'm out because I, I, I had no intent. If I was going to be there long, it would already be in, but I'm not. I'm there for a very, very short amount of time. I'm going to Gordon Gecko these things, and I'm going to get a few percentage points, and I'm going to get out. That's it. It's going to go back to cash for the next time that that day happens. So... Uh, the ones that I've been probably hitting hardest lately has been Fetch. Uh, I don't know for I I don't understand how this thing continues to fly under uh, the the Cosmos radar so much that uh, none of the none of the reporters are uh, reporting on it. Hey, guys, this is why Bitcoin. <laughs> this is why while Bitcoin is doing this. I, I don't understand why everybody just continues to treat this as the redheaded stepchild. I've made more money in Fetch. Uh, that I have in, in uh, over the last 30 days and in virtually anything else that I've been in, in virtually anything else that I've been in, because I took the damn thing from 51 cents up to where it is currently at 72. All right, guys, those are monster gains. Those are monster gains. And these are the ones that I'm going to look for. And the reason that I can get into them is because I keep a cash position. It just makes sense. Please consider it. Just please consider it, man. Look, I'm not going to be that guy that's going to tell you what to do with your money. I didn't help you earn it. I'm not going to help you spend it. So you do you, bro. But I, me doing me makes me money. So I'm going to continue to, uh, continue to do that. But 
Uh, while Fetch is doing that awry, uh, without even looking, I'm telling you, I, I'm going to tell you that it's what it, it's had a nice little run. It did follow the Bitcoin dip down, but let's look at it over the last uh, 30 days. There you go. There we go. From six dollars, uh, peaked up there just recently to seven dollars and fifty cents. AI, all right, all right. There's there's uh, there's very little AI that's represented on this thing, but it's going to run very very well with Fetch. So if one is going, you kind of got need. It doesn't hurt you to keep an eye on the other one and see what's going on over there. So uh, I've been doing well on that one. It's probably my last, uh, aside from Astro Vault. It's the last real stakes that I have, or uh, I'm sorry, stakes uh, LPs that I have and they're sitting over on awry because the APRs are just uh, obscenely high. And when they fade or the token fades, I'll be gone. I have no no deep love of it for over and over, just the way it's been running right now. So, yeah, man, just uh, keep an eye on these things, I guess is what I'm saying right there. And uh, interestingly, my my hash, my my passage, all these other ones, they, they haven't even wiggled. Haven't even wiggled with the uh, little Bitcoin dump. A little bit uh, w less than a percent, and less than a percent is is irrelevant to me. I, I'm like, that's performing, man. That thing is performing wonderfully. So uh, that's it. Those are the ones to keep my eye. I have to make an amp video today. Uh, I was over on their dis uh, on their Reddit, and they said nobody's talking about amp anymore. Nobody does amp videos. You know what? I hear you. I I hear you loud and clear. Uh, anyway, man, look, that's it. Uh, we got a live stream tonight, 1800 Central. Join us if you can. Going to be a fun one. Questions or comments, scottpodcast.com. I answer any and all. And until next time, please stay safe and please be smart with your money. Cheers.